Welcome back. This is Lone Wolf, and we're playing Vintage Story and playing on version 119.8. And let's just get a little bit more food. I want to go out and really do want to get some more. Some more uh, tin, otherwise known as considerate. And since we just found some, I want to go get it. Coal, coal, and uh, mostly full. One empty. And no need to be planting cabbages anytime soon. No need to be planting rice anytime soon. Whew, big sneeze. Got my whole body tingling. And that's something. Okay. Well, I'm just going to check on this. I know it's not ready, but I'm going to check on it. This isn't what I want to do, but uh, I have absolutely no right to complain about drifters coming in my base when I have a totally open area like this. Uh, not looking to make anything beautiful right now. So, dirt is going to work right now. If this is where my troubles are coming from, can't imagine why not. complain then I have to do my fart part first my fart first which of course isn't what I meant to say you sure that's what was coming out of my mouth though I do like this open but let's not Let's not put that there. What I'm looking for is just keeping the stupid drifters from spawning in my base. I don't know if I have more lanterns lying about. I know I can pick these up though. Because if I'm, if I'm closing myself off from this area, then this is not where I need lanterns. I need lanterns in here.
Okay, are we enclosed? No one's coming in here, but... Uh, Another light here. Okay. What I have here is all green. Yep, they could come down the stairways. Okay, so what I've absolutely done though is I have eliminated a huge spot where drifters were free to just come in, work their way anywhere through the base that they wanted to, and I am just working to reduce their means to get in here don't want them in my base. Okay, so that's a mod. It's called Easy Light Levels. I don't remember who makes it. Look it up on the mod server and it's there. And it is the only tool that I know of that lets you see what your light levels are, where things can spawn and where they cannot. And I have gone over this place with a fine tooth comb, except up there at the bedroom, because that absolutely was not um, fully covered in light. There were definitely red areas where they could spawn. And at this point, I know of no place where there is a spawnable block that is not sufficiently lit to keep them out of my base. We checked all, checked all that. Uh, they could spawn in the charcoal pit. They can't get out here. And if I don't have the dirt there, then they can spawn in there and come out here. So I've got that sealed off. No red blocks here, no yellow blocks here. Anyways. <laughs> Alright, so I apologize for the crappy sound. It accompanies my videos right now, but it is too hot for me to not use my air conditioner, and I don't have money to go and just replace it. So, this is what I have, this is how it's going to be. Let's see what I have in here. I, I don't have a shovel in here because I took that out. All right, I think I'm ready to go ahead out on a trip back to where I found the tin. This is a long trip, so I'll bring you back. And of course, uh, you know, if the activity has to be high. Might as well take a reading while I'm here. Protect myself. You foul beasts! Die! I was trying to take a reading. You must all die.
that's right, Ty. I even mentioned that, Ty. Tyron, I don't know how it is that one drifter that you can see clearly past. Ah! Blocks the spear from going through and hitting the guy behind. Of course, we've got a temporal rift right there. Trying to get back to here. Okay. Oh. Because I figured we knew there's a big chug in hole there, so kind of easy to forget. But I'd have remembered more vociferously. Ooh, that's a big word. Had I fallen into it, which I did not, thankfully. Ooh, snow just melted. Well, we are mid-February. I am running 30-day months. We had picked up on that. But that is what I'm doing. Seems to me that I came down here just fine last time. As I did. Oh, my sound has problems right now, but it's too hot to not run my air conditioner, and I don't have the money to place it, so that's just how it is. And unfortunately, it sucks. Does it always suck? Most of the time it sucks, though. Chasing you. Hyena, you. Guess this is further than I realized. Yeah, I remember you guys. And I remember not caring about you, too. Just like I just did. Didn't care about you. Huh, that is quite a bit farther than I remember. Anyways. Alright, there's the traitor. Let's go around this way.
pick up some spears, shall we? Yes, and why am I here? Because I want tin. Why do I want tin? Because I want to make tin bronze spears. Because I've seen the pleasure that they are. Come on, let's move the wolf. Ah, you can do it, wolf. Or something. Alrighty. Let's uh, get the nutrition up. Okay, uh, said medium. Okay. Let's see what happens as we go further. Probably gets worse as I go lower, but I don't know that until I do it. Yep, we've gone way past it. So we're still on it. Has it gotten better or worse? It's probably above or below between those two readings. that went to small. Nah, I didn't change much there though, did I? We know that going up took it to small. And going down that teeny little pathetic amount that I just did changed nothing. Okay. large. Yay. I do want to double check. Huh. Somehow, all right. Uh, pause because for some reason my note search radius is on the wrong setting still. Okay, so. Now it's on six, which is what I had intended it for it to be. But changing that causes you have to start the game or the server. Okay, 
very small that way. Small, okay, okay. All right, well, let's go back and check here because we're going off of a stupid 12 radius. And we'd had medium coming down here. Okay, so then we got to large. And now it is small. Wait a minute. <laughs> some and it does say it's medium in size the cigarettes kind of funny it just it's one of those ores that you have to kind of chase though you think it's just gonna stay on one level and you really should think again It's just kind of one of those all over the place sort of ores. But it reporting it as medium size tells me that there's a good quantity. So I just have to keep searching. Good grief. I had changed the notes for trees back to 12, but, or to 6, I mean, from 12. Or so I had thought. But then I, I don't know, I must have not restarted the world after I made that change. It's the only reason that it wouldn't have changed is if I hadn't restarted the world. Because, I don't know, each story kind of does what it's supposed to do most of the time. Well, I don't think that what we've done is uh, collected a medium amount of the stuff. We've done that with Dre. Trace that way. Trace that way. Well, if all we can find are trace, then we're probably pretty much done here. Trace means one or two blocks of the stuff. And it's not very far from where it says, where it reports to you that there's trace. Uh, I am going to nothing that way, and we said nothing that way, right? Trace this way. Without too much work, we should find one more block of tin. Or two. So it's still saying trace. And I'm kind of digging like as though I'm a desperate man. Though I certainly don't feel a desperate man. But 
pen is kind of a royal pain because of everything you just saw. I mean, you saw that, yeah, it's here, it's medium, and then uh, I hope you're willing to chase it all over the place because, well, that's just kind of how tin does. Okay. Could be all of it here. They're not known for their massive deposits. Although the thing that's interesting is when we had it on node search radius of 12, we did get a large reading, which makes me think that there's maybe another deposit. And that when it was in 12, it could detect them both when I put it back into 6. It couldn't find it. It's too far away. All right. Well, I really could search forever in here come up with nothing more. Not here through this tunnel. And it's nice to have Out and about to let me know. Hey, would love to would love to feed on you. Well. An awful lot of readings about Considerite around here. And honestly, I should probably feel lucky that I actually even found any. Is this where the copper is? Your Y equals 70. Well, I'm near. Near Y seventy. Okay. Okay. Well, this has been fun. I must have got that reading when I was in mode search radius 12 because we just checked just now
and we didn't get a reading down there because we've changed it back to six. But I decided to look because I knew I'd seen something, didn't know what. I get two nuggets out of each one so I'll get 80 nuggets the great thing about the great thing about pin is that it doesn't fire much it goes a long ways a little bit goes a long ways looks like we got whatever copper was here I'd love to stand around and explore a whole bunch more. Honestly, I would. So we'll collect some flowers here. Pearl pick is not dead yet. Look at that. It's looking pretty ragged. Seven. Twenty-eight. Look at all that horse tail there. I assume that that's an actual translocator that I have prepared. Let's go have a look-see at it. Mm. Welcome to the jungle. Don't exactly say welcome. Need two more bull crap. What's that? That's a sun bear. Okay. We're happy to let sun bears be. Okay, they're happy to let me be. Fun to find Purple Heart. I do have one marked. Somewhere here. Where's the Purple Heart tree? Thought it was in this area. That is to say, it's nothing that I need to worry about.
Lots of K-Pac. Normal. Very little purple heart. But you can find a bunch of purple heart to be. At least you could in previous versions. They weren't just sitting around waiting for you to come and well, actually, they were sitting around just waiting. Nothing common about. Oh, is this? This is by Henry Caratina. Look at that. Tin or uh, lead, I mean. Translocators to play with. Talk bounce me around this world. And I do have my pro bars so that I can take them apart and uh, then connect them to wherever I want. But I like finding them, repairing them, and letting them take me wherever they want to go as well. Ah, oh, sure, why not? Osh, 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 sure. Sure, man, sure. Hello, chickens. So we're in the 15th of February, so we're halfway through February. And on worlds that I've played on, I've seen winter last well into June, or be done in April, even. We have not played even one year on here. That's because of the 30-day months. Oh, no. Well, I don't know. It, I clearly have not paid that much attention to it. But I did think that we had played a year, but uh, what do I know? Actually, what I should do is uh, pause the recording and get home, and there we shall end the video. But this is a nice show. Check out this show. Isn't that a cool show? We have 
magic jumping paradoxite rock stones. All right, I'll bring you back. Well, did I find out of here before? Yeah, I think I did. I think one little block got left behind. How rude of me. Right, well, we're home. A piece of terracotta. That ain't that brand. Shows. Why'd the music stop? It's not like I just went to caving or something. Let's break it down. I'm a player that couldn't care less about the crystallized chunks. To me, that's just a separate inventory slot. I just have no imagination. Well, that is a fair bit. Okay. Got to fill up on food, I guess. Let's go check on the cementation furnace. And Betting it's ready for another half stack of coal, charcoal, brown coal. So it should be at 80 right now. So this should be the last to burn. Then there will be 16 more blister steels to process. Units. I could then turn into plates and turn this beautiful steel chain into steel plate for scale. Do you have to have chain for scale? Oh. So that gives you. 1.4 Well, it's 1.6. Okay, 90% versus 86. Whereas, of course, it's the 1.8 instead of the 1.4. 97 percent versus 86 and the well, that does definitely take your hunger rate up doesn't it yeah that's the thing the hunger rate but no well, healing effectiveness accuracy charge time lock speed <laughs> yeah it kills you Scale's not bad, I mean, honestly. And there's, uh, there's the steel chain. 
All right. Well, thank you so much for being here with me. I hope you enjoyed yourself. Uh, I certainly have had a lot of fun playing. If you like what I'm doing, please do consider subscribing to my channel. Uh, it would be very helpful. And for all of those who have already done so, I thank you at the bottom of my heart for doing that. I appreciate it. I don't take it for granted. Um, it means something to me, so thank you very much. If you like this video, click on the like button. If you are so inclined to click on dislike, please do leave a comment on the video and let me know what it was you did not like about the video. And then I can uh, learn from the experience and become a better content creator. For any of who are interested in watching my videos. At any rate, I would love to hear from any and all of you. So please do comment on my videos. I appreciate it. And as always, come watch the next episode with me, won't you? Thank you. Goodbye.